DNA polymerase DNA polymerase is an enzyme that is capable of synthesizing DNA molecules from deoxyribonucleotides DNTPs, which are the building blocks of a DNA molecule. It allows the strands of DNA to be duplicated. These enzymes store information present in DNA, allowing the new cell to contain the same information. These enzymes can use strands of DNA as a guide, or template, and assist in synthesizing the duplicate strands. They are also useful in the process of DNA repair. Mainly, these enzymes are vital for DNA replication because they guarantee the faithful duplication of DNA. Structure of DNA polymerase So far, the crystal structures that have been obtained for many DNA polymerases from all kingdoms of life have revealed a quite common structure. The overall architecture of a DNA pole resembles a human right hand and consists of three domains, palm, fingers, and thumb. Upon binding of the DNA pole to the template or primer and the DNTP, conformational changes in the DNA pole as well as in the DNA itself lead to the assembly of a DNA polymerase active site. These changes allow a catalytically competent DNA polymerase to exert its function. The finger domain interacts with the incoming DNTP and single-stranded DNA. The thumb on the other hand binds to double-stranded DNA. This double-stranded DNA is either a primer hybridized to a template or represents the newly synthesized DNA with its templating strand. The palm domain harbors the catalytic residues that bind magnesium ions which are required for the phosphoryl transfer reaction. The phosphoryl transfer reaction includes the attachment of the DNMP to the 3' OH group of the primer or the growing DNA chain and the release of pyrophosphate. The palm domain, where, as indicated, the catalytic reaction occurs, is extremely conserved in most DNA polymerases analyzed so far. Exceptions are I, the pole beta-like nucleotidyl transferase superfamily X enzymes such as DNA pole beta. 2, the DNA poles 3 from E. coli and Thermus aquaticus and the DNA pole X from Deinococcus radiodurans. Despite these differences, all DNA poles utilize the same two metal, mostly magnesium, ion mechanism for DNTP addition. In contrast to the widely conserved palm domain, the fingers and the thumbs differ in the various DNA pole families. DNA polymerase reaction Requirements A DNA polymerase needs I, the four bases in their activated form as deoxyribonucleoside triphosphates as substrate 2, a DNA template that instructs the DNA polymerase which bases to incorporate 3, a primer containing a 3' OH group at its end which is hybridized to a template, there are only a few exceptions to this, e.g. the so-called protein priming in bacteria of H529 and in adenovirus. 4. The divalent cation magnesium as cofactor. V. In some cases other proteins called DNA polymerase auxiliary proteins. Mechanism a base is incorporated by the DNA polymerase in the following four to five steps. In the first step, the incoming DNTP is bonded to the templating base with the help of hydrogen bond, adenine to thymine and guanine to cytosine and vice versa. In the second step, water is excluded from the active site of DNA polymerase. In the third step, the geometric selection in the active site of DNA polymerase takes place. In the fourth step, the DNTP binding affinity leads to an induced conformational change in the active site and in the fifth step, the formation of phosphodiester bond between the last base of the primer and the new nucleotide takes place by the release of pyrophosphate. DNA polymerases, as everything else in nature, 
can make mistakes and occasionally incorporate wrong bases to reduce the amount of those mistakes many but not all DNA polymerases contain a second activity, the 3' prime to 5' prime exonuclease activity. This so-called proofreading exonuclease activity removes non-properly paired bases. Such incorrectly base paired nucleotides can either derive from a wrong pairing of two normal nucleotides or be caused by altered or missing bases.